Hey, what's up learners? So today I'm gonna to show you how to play Fly Like an Eagle on the ukulele. It is a one chord song, but I'm teaching it with four chords, but I'll explain kind of why I look at it as a one chord song. We're also gonna include the legendary riff, and I'm even gonna show you the melody a little bit too, so you can hopefully sing it a little better than I am. New ukulele every Wednesday and Saturday. Subscribe if you like this kind of content. Double tabs, become a Patreon. All right, time to fly. Grab the ukulele brain attention span and follow me on it, and let's do it. Okay, the riff first. It took me a little while to figure this one out. We're gonna start off with an open E string, hammer on the second fret. And I'm using my thumb, after I hammer, I just keep it going and I hit that open A string. Middle finger and I'm playing third fret of the A and third fret of the E. A string, E string, third fret. We're gonna hit it two times. But it's the timings, you really have to listen to it and play along with the track because it's one E and a two and. So really try to play along with the track and if it's too quick for you on YouTube, you can slow it down. Oh yeah. After, open E, hammer on the second fret, five, five. Three, three. So really slowly. One more time, nice and slow. And this right here is the fourth beat. So you're kind of just aiming for that to help you stay in time. Do the best you can. That first half repeats itself. Do, do, do. And then we do it again, but we only hit this part once, like. And it's not do open A, it's. So that last piece is hammer on the second fret, and then three, three. Really slowly, the whole thing. Okay, and that's just one measure. So a little more up to speed. Well, let's do it slowly one more time. A little more up to speed. Okay, and that would be the speed of the record. So take it really slowly like I did, see if you can play it with slow, and then once you get it nice and tight slow, speed it up. It's only one chord, and the amount of times it goes around varies quite a bit, because it's a pretty jammy song. But we have two options here. I'm gonna show you an easy strum pattern and a harder one. The easy one is just down, 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 up, down, 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 down. The song's at 97 beats per minute, so that's one and two and a three and four and a and that would be one measure. Even though it's two strum patterns, it's one measure. That's the easy way to do it. Feed the babies who don't have enough to eat. Show the children with no shoes on the feet. All right, pretty basic, right? Now we can jazz that up though. So this more complicated strum pattern is based on the bass and it's actually two strum patterns that make two measures. So we're gonna break it down nice and slow. It's down, up, one E and, one E and up, I'm sorry. One E and a two E and a three. Down, up, down, up, down. Okay, and the second measure is a variation of that. It's down, up, same, down, up, down, up. We don't do that down, so it's down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. 
two together. Down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. <laughs> I know, it's pretty crazy, right? So you get down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. An intro to the melody would sound something like this. Seven C E. The time keeps on. Three five. Three oh, three oh, three oh, three seven, three five, three oh, three oh, three oh, three oh. C E C D C A C A C A. Three on the E string. added a slide there, give it a little bit of swagger, and some vibrato. Just straightforward. A little more swag. Now, I did say it's a one chord song, and let me explain to you, even though why it's a one chord song, I'm teaching it as a four chord song. You got your A minor again, your A minor seven, two, zero, three, zero, your Hawaiian D seven, and I'm actually playing the whole thing, pinky here, ring finger here, index here, none. So I got my pinky for the A minor seven, ring finger here for the Hawaiian D seven, an F chord, and a regular A minor. Now, I consider this a one chord song because I would just play an A minor and the keyboard player would play a G over it, F sharp, F, E. So I actually think about it as an A minor seven, A minor six, A minor flat six, A minor. That's theory-ish and if you want to deep dive in theory, let me know and I'll link some kind of chord DNA lessons in the description, but I think of it Think of that as one chord. I want to fly like an eagle to the sea. Fly like an eagle, let my spirit carry me. I want to fly like an eagle to the sea. Oh, 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 oh. I want to fly like an eagle. That's the entire tune. Over the, if you want to do a solo, it's all A minor pentatonic. Okay, and you would use that to solo over it. That's the same scale that they use to make the riff. And it's also the same scale that they're using to make the melody. All A minor pentatonic, right? And there you have it. That is how you play Fly Like an Eagle. Hope you dig it. 10 thumbs pro. So good, right? Thank you for learning. Think about becoming a Patreon if you really like this. Um, it will accelerate your learning, cheaper than a cheap cheeseburger. And if you just enjoy it, why don't you go ahead and hit subscribe and keep on learning with us. We'll catch you next Wednesday and Saturday, guitar on Monday, life is good, fly like an eagle, my friends. And uh, let's uh, close babies, got no clothes, put some shoes on the feet. Why not, right? Take care, have a lovely one, take care.